So today is April 9th. It's a Monday and it is my fourth week at my fifth rotation. And I really haven't grabbed the camera and did any kind of filming for this rotation as of yet because I've just been so busy with school and planning my wedding and doing wedding things and stuff. So I really haven't had time to really grab the camera. But this rotation is going pretty decently. Um, it's a advanced institutional rotation. So I'm at the hospital and I've just been doing different, like each week I'm with a different person and just learning what they do. Um, we've been doing a lot of bank dosing, Coumadin and heparin dosing and adjustments and things like that. So yeah, it's been a pretty decent rotation. Um, there is one pharmacist that is my favorite. She's really helped me out a lot this rotation. Um, we had to take a mandatory practice NAPLEX on Saturday, April 7th. That was three hours long. Um, the pharmacist that's been helping me is really giving me a great review of antibiotics and things like that. So I really think that helped me out with the test. I don't know how I did on the test. They have not gave us the grades that we made on the test yet, but yeah. But I just wanted to come on and give you like a quick little talk about what's been going on with me and yeah. I don't know when I'll be able to pick the camera up again for rotations, but I will try to get some footage of like the rehearsal dinner and all that stuff because oh my gosh people my wedding is 13 days away it's not this weekend this weekend is the bachelorette party so yeah i get some of that but um it's like the bachelorette party and then the wedding like i can't believe it's so close hello everyone so it is 10 days to the wedding and today, what I'm about to get ready to do now is to, I'm about to make the boutonnieres for the guys. And then I need to um, tie the bouquets. I need to embroider the bags for the bridesmaids. And we also need to do the cups that we got for the guys. So, I'm about to show you guys how to make these boutonnieres. So, we're going to do this feather look boutonniere. I have these um, feathers with the peacocks on them. And we have a couple of these. They're all squished together. There's a better one. So we have a couple of these. We have floral tape. And this is basically all that we're going to be using for the boutonniere. We're also going to be now using these for the boutonnieres because he wants to be able to pin them on and not have to um, use any of those little sticky pins. So we're going to be using those. First, we're going to start off by separating the peacock feathers from the colored feathers. After I separated the peacock feathers, I shaped them into a slight curved point, but I did not show this on the camera. Now we're going to take the purple feathers and gently pull the feathers off the bottom to expose the stem. Next, I'm going to grab two purple feathers and hot glue them together. Once they look how I want them to look, I'm going to glue a teal feather to the back. Once the feathers are in place, I'm going to take some floral tape and wrap the stem. When you're using the floral tape, you have to pull it to activate the stickiness, so I pulled and wrapped until I got to the bottom. Now I'm going to hot glue the peacock feather onto the front, and then I'm going to wrap the bottom again with floral tape. Next, I'm going to glue the ribbon onto the stem to cover up the floral tape. 
I add glue to the ribbon, then I wrap it down and add glue as I wrap. When I get to the bottom, I snip off any excess stem and ribbon and then I seal the bottom with more hot glue. Now I'm going to glue the bar pin to the back of the boutonniere and then I'm done. And now you have beautiful boutonnieres for your wedding. Today is April 17th and it is my last day at this current rotation that I'm on. Um, I am at a hospital doing my advanced institutional rotation and it's been a pretty good rotation. It has really refreshed my memory on antibiotics and bank dosing. And I mean, I was pretty good with the warfarin dosing because I had anticoagulant um, rotation. But I really appreciate this rotation. Um, it's really reminded me a lot about pain because honestly, I missed a lot of the pain lectures at school because that's when I was sick last year and I was in the hospital for a week and everything like that so it's really kind of refreshed my memory on, on a lot of that pain stuff especially since I missed out on some of that stuff last year but guess what guys I'm getting married in or my wedding I should say my wedding is in four days so it's Tuesday yeah so Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday four days until my wedding and then I'm going to go to Hawaii so um, today is my last day of my rotation like I said um, she gave me the rest of the week off for my wedding and to you know do stuff for that so I'm very thankful that she allowed me to do that and yeah I have to do a presentation today I might try to get somebody to record it we'll see. but anyway I'm going to talk to you guys later